like a boardwalk atmosphere. Yeah, you never know there was a baseball game going on over there. <laughs> Our camper is not with us, or you know, as we nicknamed it, the Aluminum Falcon. We are actually going to a national park today, but it's not the kind you think of. It is actually a National League park. We are going to a Braves baseball game, Atlanta Braves. September is full of special dates for us, one being our wedding anniversary, two being the uh, date of our or one year anniversary of getting the aluminum falcon for this year. And September is also this guy's birthday month. So we are going to celebrate uh, the last uh, regular season home game for the Atlanta Braves. And since it's close to us, we didn't bring the camper because we didn't want to try to hook up and go home after a long day at the ballpark on a Sunday. And but it could be done. It could be done. There is an RV park. 15 miles north of SunTrust Park up in Marietta, where if we wanted to badly enough, we could have dragged the Falcon up there and camped out and gone to camp. So it could be done. It could be done. We hope to show you some of the fine features of SunTrust Park in Atlanta, Georgia. And the surrounding battery. <laughs> This is our fourth or fifth, I think the fifth trip to SunTrust Park in the Remember. two seasons that it's been in existence. And we've already done this enough that we know that parking at this place is 10 gajillion times worse than the Braves' previous home, Turner Field, was. Uh, so here we are parking in an insurance company parking deck and walking across the road. As I said, we've actually been here a handful of times already, but we've never been at the club level before, so that will be a new thing today. First day splurt. Yeah. <laughs> I'm worth it. Times we've been here, we've actually not been able to indulge in this much because usually this place is a madhouse. <laughs> we're usually cutting it close right. to here too. <laughs> so you know, as you see, here's wall wall burgers, and we've we've never been in there. And I did eat at a burger place here once. There, there is, and the name of it escapes me. But there is a there is a bar up here at the corner that we did actually have a burger in one time. It was very good. And the the the, the terrapin. We we did go into terrapin. And, had barbecue, I think, one yeah, time. Yeah, microbrewery. So, so, we've got a couple things. 
See, there's your RV related material. You can get camping gear here. RVing is everywhere. shame on me for not remembering this kind of center square has a name and it escapes me at the moment but this is free game activities and sometimes post game activities uh the the braves marching bands plays here sometimes before and after games uh, all kind of social events go on here it's a little grassy knoll kind of area give you a look see and it's right outside i think it's the right field gate yeah that's right that's right field right over there so Right, time to go inside. Go to Chop House Gate. Okay, as security screens go, that wasn't too terribly Nazi-ish. So we're inside. This is the main concourse, SunTrust Park. Like that's where, that's where we just came through. And over here is the sand lot, which in my personal opinion shouldn't be here. I mean, I know kids and baseball all that jazz, but if the kids want something to do, they should go watch a baseball game. They have arcade type games, they even have uh, zip lines and different batting cages and things like that. Which if you have kids is great. You could go you could go to an amusement park you could go to an amusement park and do it instead of coming to a baseball game. <laughs> but since there's a baseball game going on, the kids should be out there watching a the baseball game. But, but usually, what do I know? Usually one parent takes the kids to the you know, sandlot. Usually mom while dad's watching the game. Drinking beer. Drink a beer. I want a hamburger <laughs> and I want a hot dog and I want a pizza. You'll get nothing in like it. Actually, no, you have to. I'll, I'll, I'll get a bunch of stuff in like it. <laughs> We're going to go check out the Clint House store because you know we don't spend enough money. Retail there. Mm. Oh, yeah. Say hey to YouTube. Let's see if we can find an excuse to give Liberty Media even more money. <laughs> So I guess Liberty Media doesn't get any more of my money today. Well, let's see if we can escape this place. Alright y'all, now we're the clubhouse store. Thank you. There you go. I demand a licensing fee. This is a neat little area coming up. This is... Is it called Braves Garden? I know it's, it's kind of sort of like the Hall of Fame. A lot of displays and memorabilia about the history of the franchise. Right there. My bad, sorry. Monument Garden. As you may or may not know, the Braves originated back in Boston and then went to Milwaukee before they came to Atlanta in the mid 60s. So this little path is full of exhibits about the long storied franchise history, about more than 100 years. Uh, actually, almost about 130, if I remember correctly. Great stuff if you're into baseball. Oh, we get free popcorn, peanuts, and Cracker Jacks for being in the club section today. That was a surprise. Look at there. 
Voilà. Mm. All right, let's take a look around. This is this is our view. Not quite dead behind on plate, but pretty darn close. Okay, top of the sixth. I think it's getting about time for either a drink, another drink, or some ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream's never a bad idea. Let's go in search of. Let's do the Leonard Nimoy thing and go in search of. <laughs> Okay, seventh inning, top of the seventh, and we've come back to our seats, and well, I say our seats, somebody's seats. <laughs> we kind of occupied an empty spot here in the club level, one of these yeah, fairly nice, as you see, uh, te techno tables, I guess, for lack of a better term, so I can keep up with the Falcons and the Braves yes. and my ice cream. We have to steal seats more often. <laughs> we didn't steal them. We just but the, the Braves are losing. It's still gotta, we got to come back. Four to one, top of the ninth. Four to one, Giants, not four to one. Bro. Doesn't look like it's our day. Once again, we came all this way to see the loss. Which, to be fair, let's face it, they were playing the B team today. They're, they're resting up everybody for the playoffs, so you know, a lot of starters didn't get any time today. It's, I knew there was the possibility. We're making excuses. Mm -hmm. but, but they're good ones. <laughs> and now for the long ride back down I-20, all the way back home after watching my baseball team lose again. Mm. Yeah, we kind of expected it. But, <laughs> but hey, the goal was to spend a lovely, su lovely late summer day out in the sunshine in the ballpark with the sights and sounds and smells and the experience and mission accomplished in that respect. I mean, a win, a win just would have been a bonus, so. Exactly. Yeah. And with the battery, uh, Atlanta, there are so many things to do, even if you don't go watch a ball game, which, you know, this guy would dream of. But if you didn't want to watch the ball game, there are plenty of other things to do. Shopping, eating, uh, hanging out with your friends, family, Music Arena, the Roxy that, Theater. Right. Roxy Theater. The Omni yeah. Hotel is there in case you're not a camper. Uh, There's a top golf facility under construction. That'll be there too. Yeah. All kind of stuff. And new stuff going up every day. Atlanta's a great area to hang out. A lot of things that they offer for different adventures. Yeah. And the goal of this channel is to show you how to have adventures without breaking the bank, having to cross the country. There are adventures to be had close to home, inside the camper and outside the camper. Exactly. And this is one of the latter. Right. So, on that note, uh, until the next adventure in the camper, uh, which will be King Kings Mountain State Park, yep. we will be doing that next. Uh, so, until then, as we always do, keep, keep living, living and learning. learning.